Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Now today I'm playing this game that I found on itch.io called the VHS Paradise. Now I don't really know much about this game, I just saw it on top of the horror story page for quite a while though. So apparently it's very good and seeing the fact that I saw not all the popular YouTubers play this, I just wanted to give it a try. So, as of now that's all I'm getting into it, I hope it's any good and let's play. Oh, we just started off right here? Oh, okay, so... Nice. Um, fuck, must be one of those fancy places with magic opening doors. Uh, so what do I do now? I guess I go over here. Uh, what's this now? Hi, Wobbit. I hope you are well. I hate this damn fever, but I'm recovering. Remember to start your shift by turning on the computer. I've left a good movie for you to watch when you finish the work. By the way... I heard that the weight of thieves increased a lot in the city, and much more at night time. I mean, you don't really hear much wobblies going off at VHS shops. Maybe it's because they don't exist anymore, but still feels odd to be wobbling in a place like that. Pay attention to what each customer is doing. If you see one leaving without paying, one, to stop him. Be very careful, John. Alright. I, I guess I'm going to risk my fucking life for this shitty minimum wage job. Why the hell is there a microwave in here? Alright, start your shift. Sure, I see. In fact, I don't think there's anything else to do. Well, coincidence, a customer just came in at the right time. What are you looking for? Oh, you motherfucker! Come back here! No, 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 no. Where, where did he go? Oh, okay. God fucking damn it. I didn't know the first customer was about to steal shit. What are you looking for? You better not steal shit. I got my eye on you, sir. No! Please, dude, I really want to see this movie, and I really want to keep my job so you could fuck off. But my parents don't want to lend me money. That's not my problem. No, that is a stupid fucking excuse. It's just a movie, right? There's no need to commit crimes for it. Yeah, that's right. That's what you fucking deserve. At least I got away with one criminal. Oh, that felt great. I finally stopped a crime. Is there no customer in here? Oh, there is. Hi, miss. How are you doing? Oh, thank you. I really appreciate it. I see you're a nice woman. You actually pay for shit. Hi, I'm taking this movie with me for two days. How much do I pay? Hi, it's three dollars. I would love this movie. It is one of my favorites. I don't have time to chat. The streets are very dangerous at night, boy. Fair enough. I mean, my boss said that as well. I'd be safe. Oh, finally, a nice customer. That doesn't try to steal anything. What do you have in mind? What sick, sinister shit are you planning on to, lady? Are you gonna pay? You better pay. I'm not doing it with no fucking thief. Yep, you're paying. Good. Let me, um, check you out. Well, I'm new in the city, you know, it's pretty, but I heard there's a lot of crime. Yeah, people keep mentioning that. Yes, be careful. Did you move here, or are you on vacation? I'm moving here with my husband. We hope everything goes well. Oh, I understand. Oh, well, we have to go. Good night. Good night, good luck, and take care. Ah, oh, fuck. Two customers in a world that are actually are fucking respectful and not dickheads. Alright. Can I help you? Oh, wait, no, she's probably going to sprint out. Oh, no, never mind. What can I help you with? Jesus Christ, that's a creepy smile. Hello, I want to end this movie for three days. Good evening, it's four dollars. Was printing movies this cheap back in the days when this type of shit was popular? I don't think they were this cheap. This must be a really good store. Here you go, my son will love this gift. I mean, it's not really a gift, seeing how you have to return it. Nope, he watches the movie repeatedly for the first few days, and then completely forgets about them. Uh-huh. Fair enough. He's 11 years old. He'll love action movies. Um, what movies are there? Oh, hello. Can I help you with anything? I don't think he's going to steal. Look at him, he's bald. Bald people don't steal anything. See? I'm right about everything. Naughty rabbit in a sexy adventure. Do you want to buy or rent it? I want to buy it. Oh, okay, it's $20. I'll 
I'm surprised you're the only cashier who doesn't look at me with disgust or rejection when he sees that I want to buy a movie like that. To be fair, we have a lot of customers like you who come in on a daily basis, so I'm just completely desensitized by it. The food is that I don't give a damn. You can go now. I also like this movie. The scenes are very exciting. Ew, Jesus Christ. I don't want to talk to that. Look at him. He looks like 70 or something. I'm sorry, but I'm not allowed to chat with customers. What? Yeah, you are. I saw you chat to the other ones. No problem. I have to close the shop now. I don't have any time to stay and talk to you. Thank you so much for your partners. Jesus Christ. Two is the weirdest one, but I think two is also the nicest. So I think I'm going to have to press it. Ew, but I don't want to. This is gross and weird. That's right. My name is Kyle. What's your name? Um, uh, Robert. Nice to meet you. Can I ask you a question? Just as long as in anything remotely sexual, then I'm fine. Are you happy with this job? Do you fulfill your dreams here? No, really. I'm just trying to get over college depth, probably. Why do you ask that? I'm curious. No, the truth is that I'm not happy. It was never in my plans to work in a VHS store. It makes me very sad to hear that. Well, it was nice meeting you, Robert. I hope to see you soon. Also, bye. Alright, see, Carl was nice too, if not a bit. Provided, I en enjoyed the porn, Coil. Well, that's my shift over. Now let's watch the movie that John left me. Alright, hope it's not something that Carl would enjoy. First, I have to turn on the off the Carl alarm. Oh my god, Carl alarms always go off at the worst possible times. Whose Carl even is this, anyway? Is this John's? I thought the mechanic had fixed the alarm problem, but apparently not. I hope John's movie doesn't disappoint me. Yep. It's pray to God. Close the shop to watch the movie. Yeah. It's really late in the night anyway, and I don't think any customers are going to come in. What a mediocre movie. I had never seen such a predictable ending. I better go home. I'm tired of being here. Okay. <laughs> what the fuck? How long was that guy behind me there? Was he just watching the movie with me? Okay... Jesus Christ. I didn't think the movie was that bad that you want to beat the shit out of me. Oh no, not Marty Mabbitts in a sexy adventure. I didn't want to watch this film. Oh shit, I had no idea I can go in this room. My toe was locked or something. Oh, so this is where I was watching the movie. Okay. Oh wait, did I mess with the microwave? Oh, John's gonna be pissed. And here is just a bunch of other movies. Okay, I guess we can go back upstairs or something. Wait, what's through here? No, nothing. Oh, right, we can go back upstairs. Okay, shit. Um, for a moment there, I realized something that I didn't really know. Um, every time you start a new game, different customers come in. Like, with, like, sometimes, like, even more people try to steal shit, and they all have something in unique to say. So I feel really shit about myself for not recording. But right now I'm gonna just stand behind this door, because I don't know if this guy's gonna steal anything or not. Yep, he's stealing shit. This movie is for my little niece, please. What? That is a stupid fucking excuse. No. Alright, what do you have to say? Who are you? Alright, so it's another old guy. All the old guys are nice. Except for Kyle. We don't talk about Kyle. Hello, friend. I want to buy this movie. It's $20. Excellent. Finally. Finally what? I have finally reached 100 movies purchased. I love collecting these wonders. Do you ever watch the movies? No, I don't see them. I buy them just to decorate my house. Are you going to pay, or what? Ah, yes, take it. Thank you very much. Bit odd, but alright. Not the weirdest person I have come into the shop. Are you Kyle? No, you're the fucking guy again! I saw you stealing shit. What the fuck makes you think you can just run back in here, no problem? We have you on security TV. Yep. That's what I fucking taught. What do you mean your parents don't lend you any money? You look 25, do you don't have any money of your own? Um, who is this? Um, 
Okay, you didn't even pick out a DVD. Um, do you have... It's up to no eight, miss? Hello, boy. Do you have the movie Dune here? How old? Wait. Dune? When did that movie come out? Long time after the VHSs were relevant. What are you on about? What time period are we in? Hello, man. That movie is currently in the cinema. It's not yet on VHS stores. Oh, I don't like the cinema. I'll have to wait then. Come here in a couple of weeks. We may have that movie on sale by then. I understand. Thank you very much. Bye bye. Bye, miss. That wasn't too bad. She was nice. She understood. I was kind of expecting her to throw a tantrum over it, but no. She understood and was very polite about it. Thank you, Granny. Uh, fucking Vin Diesel over. Oh no, it's Kyle. Ugh, uh, not Kyle again. So I want to see what other stuff I can say to him. Is he picking out two movies this time? He's picking out a lot of movies. If we're there, he just really likes porn. Yeah, hi Kyle. Naughty Weapons and Sexy Adventures. Do you want to buy a wind? Yep. I think 4 is the second most politest one. Maybe 3, but I have no idea. Let's just go for 4. Oh, I understand. Bye-bye. Yeah, you get the fuck out of here, Kyle. I don't have time for your shit. Let's have a look. Watch the movie? Sure. Ugh. Maybe it'll be better on my second viewing. I don't know. Nope, same movie. God damn it. Oh wait, he isn't here this time, what the hell? Oh, so it did change something. Okay, good. Kyle isn't here now to fucking tie me up and make me watch porn. This feels very odd, I don't know what to do now. That's pretty much it, I think. Yay, job well done. That was successful. Okay, this is a really steep road. How the fuck are any cars supposed to get here? Alright. Is that it? Wait, it's your bus for a moment there. Ending thing, you have arrived home safely. Good. Now I just kind of want to see what the other endings might be. The second ending. If I can get it, hopefully. I'm gonna give it a try. It's always this guy first. How many times does he have to go into the same fucking VHS shot to steal shit? Maybe something you find stealing? No, got you, you son of a bitch. I feel so sorry for the police in this town who always have to come back to the same fucking VHS store because for some reason everyone just only steals here. Let's see what's going to happen. Yep! I knew she would steal shit. Wants to have this movie very much. But I have no money. Have mercy. God damn it. I feel bad now, but... Shit, what do I do in this situation? Like... I'm probably broke. I probably have no money too. Otherwise, why would I be looking at this shithole? So, I guess what you're feeling you here, but also, fuck you. I wonder if I can talk to them while they're picking out the movie. Isn't this really awkward now, is it? Oh, see, he was first when it comes to picking out this movie this time. I guess I have to say one. Oh, he's probably gonna kill me after saying that. Yep, I feel like he is. God damn it. I think I pissed off Kyle. It is not a good thing when you piss off Kyle. Oh. Wait, did Kyle, did you fucking mess up with my car? Look. Yep. Let's get the fuck out of here. Boy, Kyle gets me. Yeah. Jesus Christ, why is he so fast? I have such bad sprint in this game. Oh no, not this movie again. Oh, this is the same fucking ending. God damn it. One more thing I want to try out before I think I end this video is that I do want to see what happens if you actually um fucking let all the thieves go and let them have the VHS. Oh, is he gonna steal? I should probably get this movie is for my niece, please. Oh, it's this guy again. Alright, fine. I don't know if I do have to confront them about it. I think that will make it worse for me. Don't touch me, asshole. Call the police if you want. I don't care. Sadly, I can't.
right now because I'm testing this little theory out. What happens if I let all the people who steal shit from my shop go? So how long, how many customers do I have to go through until Kyle comes around? Oh, hi Kyle. Well, coincidence, I was just talking about you. So... Four. Oh, I understand, by the way. Okay, I think I picked the right one. Hopefully something changes now. Good, he's not here, he's not here. Um, anything else I can check? No. For some reason I keep having to look around. Um, because I really forget what's at this place. So let's go home and hope the boss doesn't get pissed at me because there's so many stolen VHS tapes. Unimportanting, you were fired for being a complete in-store theft. Ah, shit. Rip. I guess that was ending too. Well, that was the VHS Paradise, everybody. I really did enjoy this game. I would definitely recommend going back into it, checking something that I might have missed. But as of now, I have to end this video here. Thank you so much for watching. Um, Please go to the store page and give this game much support. And also like, comment, subscribe. And I'll see you on the next video.